I don't know if it was like prophecy or just like like I just treated Cake better so she became more friendly toward me, but like the cat like the cat's kind of magneted to the us. You know what I mean? Yeah. Magneted. That's not even a fucking <laughs> No, they I mean definitely Cake is your cat and Lou is mine. Right. Um I mean you always had an affinity towards Cake, but she definitely is infatuated with you. Yeah. Um Cake loves Alex. To an uh, almost infuriating degree, sometimes. She, she oh. I mean, she, Cake likes me, don't get me wrong. She, I mean, she likes a lot of people. She loves men, she's kind of a hussy. You have testosterone flowing through your system. She's like, let me in on that. And she will roll around on your socks and bite your feet. But she, like, legit loves you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So yeah, she likes me okay, and, I, and I'm alright, but once Alex is up or home, she's like, all about that. Yeah. She like purrs and patty paws everything. Yeah. She lays on Alex's chest right in front of his face. <laughs> like, it's like adorable. It, she won't stop. It's... It, you can say it's adorable, but it's also very frustrating. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I wish she would lay with me anytime she does, which is very seldom. Anytime she does, I take a picture to document it. Because <laughs> it's such a rare occurrence. <laughs> yeah. Um, Lou is my magnet. Lou does not... Lou doesn't fawn over me the way that Cake fawns over you. But if I am still for two seconds, like, that little cat is on me. Yeah. Like, when I say magnet, like, I don't use that term loosely. She's, right. like, there. Yeah, so there's times where Cake will lay on me and I'll take for granted that it's Lou because <laughs> I'm so used to Lou being on me. Right. And then I'll look over and I'll be like, oh no, <laughs> it's Pants. <laughs> and then I'll take her picture. <laughs> to document that sometimes my body warmth is appealing to her. This is a long talk about cats. This is going to be an episode only about Cake and Lou. Probably two or three. Oh, sorry. No, that's fine. I hope people like cats. <laughs> the internet loves cats. I know, but like when they're not yours and you're just hearing somebody yap about how great their pet is, it's like, yeah, okay, mine's pretty great too. Like, whatever. You know? I don't know. No, I got you. I don't. But yeah, cats are amazing, you guys. I love cats. I've never understood people that are like cat haters. Sipping on cat haterade. Yeah, like I totally get if they're not your jam and they're not your preference and they're not your thing. Totally respect that. Totally get it. But these people that like, like totally jive on just hating cats. It's usually men. <laughs> I think it's because like cats come across as feminine or whatever. right. And so like these people that think their masculinity is going to be threatened by liking a cat. I don't know. Get over yourself, fuckbag! Jesus Christ! <laughs> I know dudes like you. You're not that bad. Oh. Fuck yourself. Cats are pretty great. I'm in a skull room. I had a teacher that hated cats. <laughs> you just nothing stops your train of. I'm on a I'm on a roll here. I like the skull man, Skelly Tile. Do you want me to talk about skeletons? I can talk about skeletons. I'll talk get off my cat rant. Whatever you like. No, I just feel like all these episodes are gonna be me ranting. That's fine. This uh, is so embarrassing. Why? <laughs> this is the reason why I don't listen to these things. <laughs> Cause I'm stupid shy and I don't like myself. I mean, I'm okay, but. Like, comment, subscribe if you like Shannon. <laughs> I'll send you butt pictures. Oh God, she'll do that too. <laughs> Did we tell the story about the bachelor party? <laughs> did we? Um, not on here. I think we did on our um, podcast live feed. On the live feed, right? But I okay, mean, so I for cut people, that, I cut that out. Did you? On the on the actual episode? Oh, on gonna, the episode, but it's on the live feed. It's on right? the live feed, yeah. But people don't have shouldn't have to dig through three hours of us being drunken messes to. No, but if you want to watch us be drunken messes, whoa, it's pretty great. Whoa! Holy! What is cannoli. happening? <laughs> what is going on? Is it glitching? Listen I... to the sounds. What is happening? <laughs> Play it this way. 
<laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I can't, like, light up with the door. Oh, boy. <laughs> this is the new game. Oh, you were there. Why did you move off of it? I could, I, it wasn't lined up perfectly. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? This is that dumb family laugh I was talking about earlier, guys. Let's <laughs> <laughs> see how fast I can navigate back to the fucking... What is happening? Maybe if I die and restart the thing? Can you die? <laughs> can you try to die? <laughs> oh my god, okay. I'm gonna restart the game real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Oh, hi. Hi. Wait, we're back. That I was. Don't know, was that an end? Uh, that was a weird glitch. That I don't know what the fuck happened with that. Oh, sorry. I'm playing on Facebook. Um, that was cool. It gave me exciting <laughs> heart palpitations. I was legitimately frightened. No, I liked it. Like normally, like my heart races, and I'm like, oh, this sucks. But that was like, that was funny to me. That was like a good rush, but I wasn't playing, so I didn't feel like it authentically. I just felt it secondhand. And you are toasted. I'm a little toasted, you guys. <laughs> I've been drinking wine. How long have we been? An hour and a half? I've been drinking wine this whole time. Yeah. Okay, boobs. Okay, so <laughs> comment below if you've ever ruined a bachelor party by flash. No, I didn't flash anybody. I was just showing my boobs. Okay. So, I'm kind of shy, but like, when I'm drunk... I don't know, am I shy? I feel like I'm like one of these not shy, shy people. Like, if a stranger were to start talking to me... You're laughing because I'm already off track. Like, I'm pretty open about stuff. Uh-huh. You, you can disagree with me. Well, no, I, th I think you have... Well, I mean, I know what it is. You have social anxiety. Like, depending on social, certain social situations, certain, so, <laughs> certain social situations will trigger your social anxiety more than others. Right. Um, I think the fewer people in a room, the better you are. I think the more inebriation, the better, and the more comfort of the people, comfort that you have with the people in the room, the better. Right, okay. So I have to be in a safe space with people that I feel comfortable enough with and drunk enough, and I will tell you nearly anything you want to know. Yeah, you become like very uninhibited. Yeah. Okay, so we were at a bachelor party. Let's see. That's for It was one us. of these combo bachelorette. Do you want me to start from the very beginning? Sure, go for story? it. Yeah, tell the whole thing. Okay. We went to, uh, what are they called? An escape room? Escape room. Okay. So it was. It was guys against girls, and Alex was more familiar and had more friends. No, that's not true. I mean, you were close to people in the girls' group. You have friends in the guys' like group. I was close to one person in the girls' group, but I was feeling feminine. And I want to be in the girls' group. Cause that's Alex, and I was like, "Give me the dudes." Cause that's Shane. Cause that's me. <laughs> so I was in the guys' group, and Alex was in the girls' group, and we were like verses in separate rooms. Right, cause it was supposed to be. Ladies versus dudes, who could escape the escape room first? Yeah, which are super fun and cool, by the way, you guys. Like, if you have any in your area, totally recommend it. I think there was an escape room at the last GeeklyCon. <gasps> like, uh, somebody designed one. Yeah? I think so. I, I could be wrong. I didn't do it. Here's my strength. I'm really good at finding clues, not so great at figuring them out. But I'm a good searcher. Okay. Okay. So, you're a smart guy. That's why you guys won. <laughs> You're gonna give me all the credit. I I'm gonna give you a lot of the credit. There were there were a couple of us really really jamming it out, and I think I think the actual the the bride to be did a, an amazing job as well. Right. Like she was she was She's really a clever. Smart cookie. And she like she and I worked together really well as a team. Yeah. I still say we were hindered by a ten year old or eleven or however old he was. We had our own dead weight. <laughs> <laughs> so we had like. This oh he was so sweet that poor kid he was trying so hard but he was like finding like things that like like he was pointing at the color of the wall and it was like no honey that's just the color of the wall it doesn't matter 
Anyway, <laughs> guy or the the girls totally smoked the guy's team. We like, won, like by a lot. Like, like we actually escaped the room, and oh, like twenty minutes you later, you lost. You smoked our yeah. asses. Um, I was being such a cocky son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah, you were. You were trash talking. I was like Facebook trash talking. Like girls are going down. We got our dicks whipped. So. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, what? So anyway. You got your dicks whipped? <laughs> the fuck, dude? <laughs> These are words I say when I'm, like, drinking wine. Alright, anyway, go on. I'm making new sayings. <laughs> How do you whip a dick? Move on. Okay. Let's move on. Let's, for, for, let's move forward. Fast forward. I almost said flash forward. That was a show. It was. So we... Afterwards, it was like, okay, girls are gonna go to their bachelorette party and do crafting, and then the guys are gonna go hang out and just drink and play games. Which, I mean, I was not as interested in the crafting, so... Nor I! So, so I went like, to, I, I was like, okay, we're gonna unswitch to go, so yeah, I can go to so the bachelor Alex party. so Alex is like, he's gonna go to bachelor party, I'm like, me too, cause... <laughs> So we both went to bachelor party. So I tagged along to bachelor party. I feel kind of like a dick now because I didn't make sure it was... Did I make sure it was okay? Yeah, you did. You did. did. I? Okay. Yeah, yeah, All right. Yeah. So I'm not too bad of a dick. So bachelor party, which was really chill. I mean, it was just hanging out at a dude's house and drinking. And drinks, guys. And I like being nude. <laughs> Like when I'm not being stupid and self-conscious. I really like nudity. So we're hanging out and we're just sitting around a table playing a game. And I was super aware, again, said this on our live feed, super aware that there were people there that might not be comfortable with, with it. So I wasn't like stripping down, flashing people. Come on, vouch for me. I wasn't... No, yeah, I was just letting you tell the story. Okay, <laughs> you're sitting there snickering though. <laughs> a funny story. So I have like some pictures on my phone, as I often do. <laughs> <laughs> of, of your sloppy yobs. Of my sloppy yobs. <laughs> and I was like, okay, who wants to see tits? I will send you a picture via your phone. Give me your phone number. Again, aware that there were people in the group that might not be cool with it. So, you know, then they, I just don't send them a picture, right? Cool. They don't have to see it. I'm, I, you know. Participation, uh, voluntary. Right. There's my respect. Everyone could opt in. Yeah. Yeah. And if you don't want to, don't give me your number. So there were people that didn't give me and, their numbers. And everyone there was above age, I believe. Yes. Who was claiming that kid was still there? Because he was not. They left. Okay. There was a kid there, but he left much before. Yeah, he was not there at the time. I'm not that dumb. I get stupid when I'm drunk, you guys, but I'm a little smart still. Besides, I was not like, f again, it was not in person flashing. It was all via phone. It was all very private messagey. So shortly after I'm doing this, uh, the stepfather of the groom <laughs> excused himself to go. And like, I didn't, re it didn't register. I just thought, oh, he's, you know, he's tired and it's late. Right. He's going home. So the next day, one of the attendees was like, yeah, he left because you made him super uncomfortable, Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> Which, and, and not a recipient of the boob pictures. Yeah, it didn't ask for them. Didn't ask for them. I didn't show them. He All he knew was that I was sending them to other participating members in the group. Right. That's all he knew. Yeah, so I guess I made him leave. Part of me feels bad about it. Part of me does not. <laughs> Part of you does not. I would, cause it's a bachelor party. Right. Crunk that shit up, goddamn. <laughs> Crunk that shit up, goddamn. Like, it was so nerdcore. Like I was bringing boobs. There were no <laughs> boobs. I'm yelling about boobs in the mic. <laughs> yeah, you are. I'm so passionate about tits, you guys. But yeah, like, the bachelor party was, hey, let's sit around and play mediocre board games. Which and... is fine. Yeah. But I was bringing boobs to the people that wanted boobs. Right. Let me know if that was a bad thing. I don't know. Well, it, first of all, it's your body you could do, like, share it with whom you want. And, and also, it was an opt-in thing. 
Like, you weren't forcing it upon anybody. Right. And well, I mean, I guess maybe there's this guilt that I showed myself in a bachelor party when I wasn't particularly close with the groom. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yeah, I'm going to your thing because I want to drink. <laughs> right. So there's some guilt there. And then to learn that I made someone uncomfortable enough to leave. I mean, I do... F <sighs> yeah, I don't know. Whatever. The people that got the pics were pretty satisfied, so I'm okay. You know the problem with me doing this, though? <laughs> What's that? Is, like, sometimes I get, like, like then people expect it from me and are like, oh, yeah, Shannon will do this. Right, but, like, yeah, that's like, terrible. I, I yeah. want to do it of my own volition. Right. Like, as soon as you, like, make it, like, a thing where, like, oh, hey, like, <laughs> she's a party trick. And then I'm like, eh, yeah, that's not kinda, really in the mood now. That's a little gross, yeah. Like, am I, I don't know, am I being a jerk? No, it's your fucking body. Right. Like, I'm not trying to be, like, they're not terrible people. I just, as soon as you make it, like, like, watch what I can get Shannon to do, then I'm kind of turned off by it. Oh, right, of course, absolutely you would be. I mean, I can, I can understand, like, if somebody said it as a joke. Like, oh, Shannon, she does that. But, like, oh, yeah, no, I have a total sense of humor about it. Right, but if somebody's like, you do this now, like, that's fucked. Yeah, when you're like, hey, hey, friend that Shannon barely knows, she'll do this thing. I'm like, nah. <laughs> I mean, maybe it would have happened, but now you kind of ruined it. Right. Yeah, that's... I don't like that. <laughs> That's weird. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Boobs. Boobs are pretty great, though. Sometimes. Uh-oh. Is Pig Ganon. It is Pig Ganon. I have to... Okay. So here's the thing. Uh. I got to fight this bad guy. Where are you? Damn it. Fuck. Uh, keep talking. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I like totally zoned out. Yeah. I like checked the time and I forgot we were recording a thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. I was, I was getting very meta about nudity. I don't know what words I'm saying right now. They don't make sense. Yeah, meta doesn't make a whole lot of sense. It doesn't. As soon as it came out of my mouth, it was like, that's not right. Why can't I hit him? I don't- he's invisible. Is he supposed to be invisible? Yeah. Oh. Um... <laughs> Was that it? Yeah. Oh, yep. well you, Yay! Boom. He turned into a dust pile. And now I have to find my way to Zelda. Oh. oh. <laughs> Which is... She's over... way over there. Excuse me. I think she, I think I know where she what is because there, all those doors were blocked off and I couldn't get to them. I think that's why I couldn't open those doors. And I was so frustrated earlier. Yeah, but I like nudity. I wish, I wish sober me was comfortable enough to just be naked when I wanted to be naked. Yeah. Yeah. So that that's your cues, everybody. If you're wishing and she's drunk, don't be a creep, <laughs> and then she might get naked. Yeah. Don't expect it. <laughs> It might happen. <laughs> no promises, because it doesn't happen every time. Right. Sometimes I don't feel like being naked. Sometimes I do. Especially if like people are selling it to other people. Like Yeah, that kind of weirds me out a little bit. That that would weird that should weird you out a lot of it. That's not that's like really Yeah. It's really not okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, uh oh, I'm gonna rescue my bay. Oh, it's Link. Oh, you're Zelda. Oh, right. I didn't know they were going to switch Link. I thought I was going to make out with my twin. <laughs> I, I rescued my bae. Yay. I rescued my girl. My boy. I'll give him a kiss on the cheek. Thanks. You're the heroine of Hyrule. Yeah. Is this the end? Yeah. I... Finally. Peace returns to Cake. Hyrule. This ends the story. Kiki, stop it. So what'd you think of the I don't OG know, I, I like ranted about cats and boobs a lot. Yeah. That's what I'm stuck on. Ten 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 ten. I want my Nonchan. I want what did it, what do I want my last name to be? 
I hear like weird last names and I'm like, I want that. <laughs> or just words. Yeah. Like I want my last name to be Pancake. I want to be Shannon Pancake. I used to call you Shannon Pancake. No, you're Banana. Oh, right, I call you Banana Pancake. Yeah. I want to be Shannon Pancake. Short stack. No, no, no. If your name was Pancake, I'd call you Short Stack. Call me that. No, call me that anyway. <laughs> okay, I said Short Stack, and you're like, no. Because and then we're like putting it with a pancake theme. I want it to be separate from the pancake theme, <laughs> and to just be my nickname. Alex used to call me <laughs> Shano. Um, back in high school, and then all of his friends started calling me Shano. And none of them call me that now, and it makes me so sad. Somebody call me Shano. Give me big hearts in my life. <laughs> hearts. You're falling apart. Give. You're I will send you love if you call me Shano. At first, I didn't like it that much. Just it, but now, now I do, and I miss it, you guys. Um. I miss being called nicknames. <laughs> I feel like I'm loved when people give me nicknames. I call you Banana. I know, and it's cute. I'm talking about other people now. Other people need to step up to the plate, even though I don't give anybody nicknames. I don't I don't give anybody nicknames. I'm kind of a jerk. I'm a selfish jerk, you guys. What is wrong? I'm like such a twat. I'm like, do all these things for me. Make me feel special. Oh my god. But at most, no. at most I'll do for you is I will pick you up a pizza and I will make you You're a lunatic. cookies. You're going crazy. I. This is this is what happens. Oh my is God. this what you all wanted? What? Because I'm giving it to you right now. Alex is in the kitchen shouting at me. Dad. I'm talking to myself. What are you doing? On the microphone. Stream of consciousness. Practicing. This is, this is the first time we beat a game. Practicing words. I guess it was a good game. I have no affiliation to Link and Zelda whatsoever, you guys. It doesn't, like, tug on my heartstrings, like I'm sure it does some of you. We beat Wave Race, too. Never mind. I don't... I have nostalgia for Wave Race, but I'm not, like... My heart doesn't bleed for it. What are you doing? What game does your heart bleed for? Harvest the... Moon. Oh, we can't play Harvest Moon. I didn't say we would. You asked me a question and I answered it. This is this is the end of your show. Look at look at that flashing bugle that stabbed oh, into a pile. Uh, you've gone crazy. Of salsa. You. <laughs> it's. You could say tortilla chip. Look at that! Look at that flashing tortilla <laughs> chip. Not a Dorito, just a plain tortilla chip, stabbed into that brown. Spicy salsa pile.